Hi guys and welcome to today's video. I'm going to be showing you in a photo how we can create our own presets and also how you can share these with, with other photographers or friends who also use a photo. So I've got this image from a recent Valentine's Day heart photo shoot we did and I've done all my adjustments here but I want to save this preset in case we ever do this shoot again or we do another red theme I can see um, if these settings would actually work on a pre on the next shoot. So, so if we go down to here and click save preset it's going to come up with this window. Uh, we will call this preset red one um, just so just to keep it simple and here you've got a list of uh, filters and if we click down on these arrows, we can then pick which of these settings we'd want to be copying uh, forward. Now, I personally uh, ha have them all all ticked, unless specifically uh, I don't I, I don't need them, such as cropping or background adjustments or clothes and accessories adjustments. And in portrait retouching, uh, I I normally use uh, presets for um, skin retouching with a voter. So I am going to turn the rest of these off. Um, because each shot will be slightly different um, in terms of clo clothing, teeth, eyes and things li like that. So I will turn those off for now. And once I am happy, I'm going to put this in a new group called Valentine's Day Preset. And then we're going to put Save as New. So that's just going to take a little second. And then what will happen is we will find it up here as well. Now what you can do, so if we just go on to our next image here, we can apply that preset really easily and it'll just change those those over. So now I've got two images looking the exact same. So this is also going to speed up your workflow as well. Now if we go back to our red one and we click these three arrows. Now if we do want to make further adjustments and then we'd want to update this preset, you can easily do that here. But if you go to share presets, it's going to come up with a window with a code. Now, can you see this code that uh, with the, that's as a voto and then a number of letters? So once we have our voto code, we can then go up to presets at the top here, click the plus, and then we can import presets, and then you can use a preset token, and you can put in that code to then download that preset and uh, add it add it to your collection. Now, the more uh, we are using a voter. We are building up a, a selection of different presets uh, for you. So if you are in, interested in our presets, please also let us know. I run a lot of photography events. So this is, is quite handy. If any of my guys use a voto, I can send them this if they want to achieve the, the same final look that uh, I, I do. And it helps them, them also improve their photography too. So I think this is a really, really cool feature you can actually do. So Voto are sponsoring this video. They are doing a 15% off if you use our discount code in the description. Thank you so much uh, for, for watching. Please consider liking and subscribing and I'll see you all in the next video.